today's video is going to be another DIY room decor video. I absolutely love this one, and if you guys enjoy it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, and let's just jump right into it. First up is this flameless candle. It's really good because it's super safe for dorm rooms as well as your house. What you're gonna need for this is a mason jar, some white feathers, and then you are also going to need these LED light candles. I got a two pack for a dollar at the dollar store. This DIY is extremely simple, anyone can do it. So remove the lid from your mason jar and then take one of your LED light candles and place it on the lid. Add as many feathers as you would like to your mason jar. And once you're done with that, you're just going to flip over the mason jar and screw it back onto the lid and you're completely finished. Next up is this crate, either nightstand or bookshelf. You can really use it for whichever one that you would like. For this, you are going to need some liquid nails glue. These string lights that I used, I will link them down below. And then you are going to use wooden crates and depending on how tall you want your bookshelf, you might want more, but I just used two of them for this. So just kind of stack them on top of each other just so you can get an idea of where you're going to put the glue and just make sure that it lines up evenly. So you're just going to begin and add your liquid nails glue. Um, be really generous with the glue because you're going to need a lot so it will stick together. After that, you're just going to place the crate on top of the glue and after you've placed it on top of the glue, you just wanna make sure that you secure it to the glue by just like pressing it down and allow this to dry for 24 hours. After that, I'm going ahead and adding my string lights. This is what they look like. They are safe for this, so I will put the exact ones I got listed down below, but you're just basically going to loop them in and out of the holes in the crate, and this is going to add a really cool light up effect to it when it's all done. So this is what it looks like after you plug it in. It looks super cool, but what I did to make it match my room a little bit better is I added this really cute fur rug from Ikea. It's totally optional. You could also paint the crates to make them match your room, but I just kept them wood because it matches with the new theme of my room. And yeah, you're all finished. Last up, but I think it's my absolute favorite, is this tiled mirror. I saw it at a furniture store and it was super expensive and I looked for a cheaper alternative and I couldn't find anything under $200, so I just decided to make it myself. All you need is a piece of wood, some liquid nails, and then these mirrored tiles that I actually got at the dollar store. So pretty self-explanatory. You're just going to glue them on the wood, and you can totally get the wood cut whatever size you need at your local hardware store. And yeah, so you just get it cut the exact size, so all you have to do is take your liquid nails and then glue the tiles on. Don't worry about getting too many fingerprints on them or even the glue. Some simple glass cleaner will clean it up really nicely and make sure you let this dry for 24 hours and you're all done. I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. They will both be linked down below. And check out my channel for more DIY videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!